If you're a language lover like me, you should definitely be using italki. On italki, you can practice the languages you're learning with native speakers for free and you can also take classes with certified teachers from the comfort of your home. And they are still offering a great, great promotion to my viewers. So if you sign up on this link in the description of the video and take one class, you get the second class free. So you should definitely take advantage of this promotion. Oi. The first difference between Portuguese from Portugal and Portuguese from Brazil is that Portuguese people tend to speak with their mouth more closed and Brazilian people tend to speak with their mouth more wide open. É, obviamente, a parte dos aeroportos e das viagens, eu já estou cansadíssima. E, normalmente, os aviões estão sempre apanhados às, às 5 da manhã. Tem que ir às 5 da manhã sempre para o aeroporto. Zé, me dá uma volta nesse jeito que a gente tira foto, vai, vídeo, bota no Instagram. Aí, um pouco mais, aí eu dou um rolê na volta. Obrigada, aí pede quando você precisar. Não, tá ótimo. Another difference is the S sound. So people from Portugal tend to pronounce the S in many cases, especially when the S comes at the end of a word, as a SH sound, like shh. And in Brazil, people tend to pronounce the S sound in many cases as So, But there are exceptions to this rule. For example, people from Rio tend to pronounce the S at the end of words as a SH sound, like in Portugal. But a good example to see this difference is the word português. So people from Portugal pronounce the word português as português. And in Brazil, people usually pronounce the word as português. Eu falo português. Eu falo português. The third difference refers to the use of the second person pronoun in the singular form. So in Portugal, they use the pronoun tu. And in Brazil, we use the pronoun você. In Portugal, the pronoun você is very formal. It's a formal way to say tu. But in Brazil, we use você all the time. It's not formal at all. If you want to sound a little bit more formal in Brazil, you should say something like you sir, like o senhor. But there are also exceptions to this rule. In some states in the south of Brazil and in the northeast of Brazil, some people use the pronoun tu also. But in most parts of Brazil, we use the pronoun você. Tu falas português? Você fala português? There are also many, many differences in vocabulary between Portuguese from Portugal and Portuguese from Brazil. One of these differences is the word bicha. So the word bicha in Portugal means line. And in Brazil, the word bicha is a pejorative way to say homosexual. And if you want to say line in Brazil, the word is fila. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, leave a thumbs up or a comment. I'll see you next week. Bye bye! Deus. Ciao!